coverage on a day of bombshell developments in SA's coronavirus crisis. There are serious health concerns in South Australia. There has been sweeping restrictions that have been reimposed here in South Australia. South Australians prepare to go into total lockdown. G'day, Tom from the Crown Inn at Kingston here. Well, it's Friday afternoon in the front bar of a hotel in a busy tourist town, and there's no one here. We had 20 staff, um, and all but myself were stood down. So significant impact on the business. While it's been really difficult, it's been really hard work, it's been really challenging, it's been really frustrating, um, and sometimes it's just been downright sad to see how it's affected um, our team members. I'm really hopeful that this is just going to be one or two weeks. So mm. I just want to think about getting through this week then starting to make some plans for next week and hope for the best. And there's a lot of our staff and managers who are just honestly traumatised by what happened last time. And, um, and you're not speaking to them now. And it's just, they are so terrified and so we. Mm. We don't want to have to go through this again. We would never have dreamed that a global pandemic would have forced us to lock our doors, shut down our bars and kitchens and send our staff home. And we were devastated. But what we do is we look forward and we think positively. We've been through some busy times in Melbourne Cup, Grand Final, the festive season ahead. And the fact that our industry has done such a fantastic job is a credit to, to everyone and it needs to be acknowledged and it needs to be appreciated. I thank you everyone for your compliance. Thank you everyone for your cooperation. Hopefully we continue to be rewarded in that area. Well done.